Friends and family of Lorenzo McKittrick are honoring his life by sharing some very special moments they shared with him. The 16-year-old's body was found behind a Fitchburg shopping center last week. News 3's Marco Span joins us now with how his friends want him to be remembered. Angela, some devastated students tonight. Now, friends of Lorenzo McKittrick say a candlelight vigil was the perfect way to remember a friend who used humor and funny voices to brighten everyone's day. It's not fair what they did to him, and I felt he deserves so much better than that, and he deserves this. Fun-loving and good-hearted were some of the words used to describe Lorenzo. Dozens of friends, family, and teachers gathered at West High School in Madison to pay tribute to the fallen student. One of his classmates says his presence was always a bright spot in her day. We talk about anything than him just waving to me in the hallway, even when I'm upset, make me feel better. One of the students who coordinated the vigil says she and his other friends needed to say goodbye. And for those who won't get to meet him, they want his legacy to reflect his life, not his death. I didn't want him to be remembered as a person being found next to a dumpster. I wanted to be like remembered as a human being and as a friend he was to a lot of people here. The students presented his brother with a framed picture of him. Even as the tears flowed, they found a way to share memories of their friend. I will miss him a lot. Karen says Lorenzo was optimistic about his future. At 16 years old, his life was just beginning to flicker. But now that light has been dimmed too soon. We were talking about our future. That was the last conversation I had with him. And now it's just sad because he doesn't have a future. He's gone. Lorenzo's desire to help people didn't just stop with his friends. Karen tells me Lorenzo wanted to go on to college, and he hoped to one day be a social worker. A huge loss. Thank you very much, Margot.